Hello listeners, I'm Asha Joksi, Vice President and Sector Head for Banking at Ikra Limited. And through this podcast, I'll be sharing our views and our expectations on the near-term liquidity conditions. Overall, systemic liquidity continued to tighten with a daily average systemic liquidity surplus narrowing to just 0.1% in Q4 FI23 from comparatively higher levels of 0.8% seen in the second quarter of financial year 23. Besides this, the average rates for the 91-day, 182-day and 364-day T-bill also rose by a higher quantum in relation to the 250 BIPs hike in the policy rate with reflecting tight liquidity conditions. In order to manage liquidity, RBI conducted 14-day VRR auctions in February and March 23, as well as fine-tuning VRR auctions, which cumulatively infused liquidity of rupees 1.88 trillion in Q4 FI23. While liquidity conditions ease back towards the end of April 23, systemic liquidity has broadly fluctuated between deficits and surpluses since September 22. Further moderation in durable liquidity from the current levels could result in sustained systemic liquidity deficits in the second half of financial year 24, which may also lead to a CRR cut post-August 23. Against this backdrop, corporate bond spreads are also expected to widen uh, through financial year 24. All the bond issuances should remain strong at 8.5 to 8.9 trillion and outstanding bonds to rise by 6 to 7% by March 24. Thank you for listening and stay tuned for our upcoming podcasts.